<laughs> Ladies, we all love prancing around in our high-heeled shoes, but let's be honest, those things kind of hurt. From being too tight and even sometimes too big, we definitely grit and bear the pain to look cute in our high heels. But what if they didn't have to hurt so much? I'm going to show you a few hacks that will help your high heels feel less painful. When a pair of shoes are brand new, the pain can be simply unbearable. That's until you've broken them in, of course. Instead of suffering through, just apply heat with a blow dryer to loosen up the tight spots. Then take a pair of socks and roll them down about halfway, just enough to cover right past your toes. Wear these heels around the house to help break them in. I'm sure you have a pair of heels that you absolutely love, but they are just a tad bit too big. The shoes slipping off the back of your heel can be annoying, and most importantly, this can cause them to become dangerous to walk in. Grab a dish sponge and cut it to match the shape of your foot. Then simply place it at the heel of your shoe. This adds more room to fill the gap, and it even adds a little bit of cushion for comfort. If you are anything like me, then your feet continuously slide forward in your heels. An easy hack for this is to apply baby powder to the bottom of your feet. The baby powder will help absorb some of the moisture and give your feet a tighter grip. Sometimes it's not the height of the heel or the style of the shoe, but it's our toes that are causing the most pain. Taping your third and fourth toes together will alleviate some of the pain from wearing high heels. Sound crazy? The proof is in the science. There's a nerve that splits between those two toes, which causes pain when pressure is put on it. And there you have it. These high heel shoe hacks will definitely keep you comfortable all day long. I wanna know down in the comments if you guys have any other high heel shoe hacks I may not know about, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. All right, Kayla just tried the sponge hack, and I'm gonna try it in a little segment called Paul Tries the Hack that Kayla previously did in the segment before the hack that Paul tries the hack. So what he does is he puts the two sponges into the shoe. These are size 11 heels that I got. I'm normally a size 12, but hopefully I can squeeze in. I, there's not a difference. There's not a difference between men's and women's sizes, are there? Anyway, so bam, it's a little snug, but there we go. All right, oh gosh, I feel beautiful. How do you do this every day? Either way, the sponge hack is working. This seems to be working pretty, oh, ah, ah, ah. Ah.